I was signing the contracts on Wednesday. So soon? There's no point in waiting. I don't want Kath getting cold feet and pulling out. Yeah, that would be a shame. Is everything all right? Steve's gone missing. Missing? Are you sure? He's not where he normally sits. Maybe someone's moved him. Well, obviously. He can't get up and move himself, can he? But who? That's what I want to know. So you're taking this eating for two things seriously? Unless you want this in your face, I wouldn't mention it again. Oh, don't be so sensitive. I was the same, remember? No, you weren't. Yeah, I was. I just hid it better. I just get those big packets of crisps and eat them in my room. Really? Mm. Well, that makes me feel better. What are you doing here, anyway? You're staying for dinner. We've got nothing in, so I'll have to order a pizza. No, I've been in the office all afternoon, just checking the accounts, making sure everything's OK. Why wouldn't it be? Because we're a family business, and when we bring in silent partners, I worry. And how thoroughly did you check them out? Very. It wasn't just me, either. Dad gave it the once over, and so did his solicitor. Yeah, well, you should have asked me to help you. You weren't here. You left us to it, and you just hate the fact that I've solved our financial problems. Look, I worked hard to get this deal. I'm not going to let you mess it up for me. So? Pint. I think you should just go home. To what? So go on, give me a little sarky comment about me and Vanessa. Nothing to do with me. Didn't see it coming, like. Mm. I did. Turns out Gaydar does exist. Uh, personally, I think you two make a great couple. It's just a shame she dumped me for dad. Well, thank you, but it's a one-off anyway, so... And, hey, here's the reason that Aaron dumped you. Shame your one-off ruined your life, eh? An orange juice, please, Charity. And a packet of cheese and onion crisps. Actually, could you make that too? Oh, what's, what's up? Oh, just the usual. My sister thinking she's right all the time. She's got it into her head that there's a problem with Kath's investment. Well, where's she got that idea? I hope you told her it's nothing to do with her. Well, I tried, but you know what she's like. She thinks she's the only one that knows how the business works. No, well, she's not. You've proved that, and your dad's really impressed. That's what this is all really about. She's jealous. Don't let her get to you. <gasps> Thank you. 